Okay, good morning. Uh, what I'm currently working on is a P1128 throttle control motor lock malfunction. If, the, uh, if I accelerate normally, the car will drive fine. Even if I eventually get to full throttle, everything's fine. But anytime <clears throat> I do a sudden acceleration and stand on the throttle, like to take off from the red light or race somebody, the car would immediately lock out. It'd go into limp mode. Check engine light will come on. Uh, no acceleration. Pull over, shut it off, start it back up. Everything's fine. Uh, once I was able to get my communication wired, <clears throat> hooked up to the Aristo ECM, uh, basically I was able to pull a code out of it, and it was P1128. Uh, so, uh, anyways, there's the throttle body off. Here's the 2JZ GTE throttle body, and here's the guts. Uh, what we have here, this little gear connects right here drops down so as the throttle motor tells it what to do it sends it all the way up to here which connects to the throttle body blade and the throttle position sensor sits here here's the cover and it sits like that <clears throat> so anyways here's the purpose of this video uh, whenever you get the code P1128 <clears throat> throttle control motor lock malfunction uh, they say to replace the throttle body. They don't say anything about check this, check that. And I presume it's because they don't necessarily off, want to offer you just the motor. Now, this motor, <clears throat> this particular motor, not only is an electric motor for operating it, but it also has two wires in here, which are the circuit for the clutch. Now, this clutch, I believe, is in the event that there is a short or something happens where the electric motor wants to go full power or do something it's not supposed to, the engine computer now has the ability to disengage this clutch so that all hell doesn't break loose. So the motor can go wide open, spinning crazy, and the clutch is not engaged so the car won't take off accelerating and you know crash and burn or whatever. All right, ultimately, purpose of the video, here's what I want you to see. This is the one that I believe is defective and that I'm going to be replacing, and here's what I found. Listen. Smooth. Real fast. Obviously, there's an issue with the clutch in there. It's not spinning the electric motor. I don't feel resistance like I'm turning armature and brushes and all that. This is just the clutch and you can hear it. Now here's the new one. Oh, by the way, it's made by Ason or whatever, which is the original manufacturer of the parts for this throttle body. See right there? See the... I guess you can't. Down at the bottom below Toyota it says Ason, which is OE stuff. So, hell yeah. Anyways, now listen to this one. That's it. Two wires for the motor, two wires for the clutch circuit. Let's get this bad boy put in. I got to get this little screw out of the way, pull the three screws, pull the motor.